we are the last line of defense. So when all the hard kill systems fail, we can be able to fire off my chap or my Nolka, and I'll be able to save the ship. And I feel like that's the most important part of our job. We're also we're the ears of the ship. We're providing direct intelligence that warfare commanders uh, use, and also that directs national level tasking. The majority of our uh, students end up going to a ship, so about 80% of our students end up graduating from Shipboard Operations course, and they go to a, a ship that's deployed anywhere out in the world, stationed in San Diego, Everett, Norfolk, Japan, or uh, Road to Spain. So their primary job is to do anti-ship missile defense, and then on the other end of the spectrum, we have a traditional CTT job. They use uh, overhead systems and work with various other uh, agencies, such as the NSA, National Security Agency, in order to conduct uh, electronic intelligence and be able to support the fleet back on a, a base on shore stations. Some of the basic things that your first session sailors are gonna learn is just gonna be knowing and understanding the RF spectrum and knowing how modulation works, what different types of modulations you have, understanding what types of missiles there are, and how to defeat each one. And you have your uh, ship ops and your maintenance, if you're gonna be going to a ship, and then if you're going to the shore side, you have intermediate opulent or IOE. Uh, then once you're out there, you have your fleet schools, which ranges from just basic operations to more in-depth knowledge takes time to understand things and to gain information. Even though you've done something like that in the past, you have to be patient with progression and, and working on different types of equipment that you've never worked on before. It takes, um, it takes time to, to study the books. You gotta take time to study the books. You gotta take time to uh, learn from other people, to ask questions. You can be a new accession sailor or you can be a, a fleet returnee or somebody coming back from the fleet in order to gain that extra additional training. Remember, you can't tell everybody everything because of the nature of our job. So find little ways to explain to your family what you're doing without diving too deep into it. And so that was a very difficult thing at the beginning for me. Really, Pensacola is a great town. It's really fun to be here and just focus and study and get through it. Fleet is the fleet. You'll get to see amazing places. There's definitely some cool spots that you can hit on the point. We join the Navy. We join the Navy. We join the Navy.